Hi guys, welcome to the show. So today's topic is, was Kurt Cobain ambidextrous? So in my book, Humans Are Amazing, Discovering Your True Self, I propose the idea that all people should learn how to use both hands to strengthen their body and their mind. So as a way to try to prove this, I look up people who are ambidextrous and use them as an example. So I was extremely happy when I found out that Kurt Cobain was ambidextrous. So some people can say that they consider Kurt Cobain cross hand dominant because he's using his hands to do different tasks. But I would also consider to say that he was ambidextrous as well. So I'm just so happy because Kurt Cobain is one of my childhood heroes. And I could just remember growing up, me and my brothers listening to Nirvana, my cousins, friends, enjoying Kurt Cobain and Nirvana's music. But of course, Kurt Cobain was the lead singer and the songwriter and Nirvana was basically his band. And well, I was really into Nirvana. So one day I was on the web and I just happened to see a picture of Kurt writing and he was writing right handed. So I thought to myself, oh, well, that picture is probably flipped. And uh, I noticed also in the picture that there's a sprite can and the letters they were reading from left to right, like normal writing. So I said, wait a minute. I thought Kurt Cobain was left handed. So I looked up more pictures of him. And so, yes, Kurt Cobain's right handed. And to me, I was like, what? That's crazy. Because that's exactly what my book is talking about using both hands equally. So now I'm doing a series where I'm talking about many different people who use both hands to do different tasks. And these people excel as well. It's quite curious if you think about it. Because the percentage of people that are left-handed are 10 to 12%. So within those 10 to 12% of people, there's a percentage of people that play guitar. So out of that small percentage of left-handed people that play guitar, they become very great. So I asked the question, will playing the guitar left-handed make you a better guitarist? So I practice using guitar and I use them to play. So I practice using both hands equally and I use them to play the guitar as well. And I can play left-handed and right-handed. I'm gonna be honest, I feel like I have a lot more fun playing the guitar left-handed than right-handed. When I play guitar right-handed, for some reason, it feels very boring. And I can't explain it. It just, I don't know why. It's boring playing guitar right-handed. But as soon as I play guitar left-handed, I can play so many songs. I, my memory just kicks in. I remember all the notes, all the parts. Also, I'm going to let you know that I feel like my left hand has a lot more energy when I'm playing. I have no idea why. Like, it's so much easier. What's weird is that um, like I was considered to be born right-handed, but as I mentioned, I started using my left hand in high school. So that's been over 15 years. And so I've been doing many things such as playing the guitar. And uh, you know, I feel that I can play left-handed way better than right-handed. That is so weird. So I asked myself, are left-handed people better musicians? And I believe they are. Based on my experience, I believe that playing left-handed is better than playing right-handed i mean i'm not gonna knock all the great right-handed playing guitarists but i feel that they should learn how to play guitar left-handed as well so they could see what i'm talking about that's my point 90 percent of the world's population are right-handed and so there's a few minority of people left-handed that's 10 to 12 percent and almost zero people in the world are ambidextrous statistically it's under one percent so yes that means there's hardly anybody who's ambidextrous pretty crazy if you think about it but when you have somebody who's ambidextrous they're amazing like Kurt Cobain I really hope that you're enjoying this information and you're kind of thinking about it if you decide to start using your weaker hand just remember to do it in an orderly manner. And what I mean is uh, try to get a spiral notepad and keep a journal. 
because then daily you will write down what you're thinking and also practice your writing so it's very great to uh, document what you're doing also get a guitar if you're right-handed stream the guitar left-handed and start playing left-handed if you're left-handed stream the guitar right-handed and start learning how to play right-handed the more that you practice keep track of the way you feel and also you know take it easy go ahead and leave me a comment below of what you think do you think Kurt Cobain was a better musician because he was left-handed and also what you think about my idea of practicing your left hand have you ever tried and is this encouraging you to try and use your left hand and so this is me ultimately trying to spread an idea and I hope that idea helps you so stay tuned because I have plenty of other famous ambidextrous people and I don't want to spoil the surprises. So check out my other videos. Keep on rocking. So hit that like button. Also smash that subscribe button. I'll see you on the next episode and stay amazing.